Hey everyone, so it is 7 o'clock and I have been up since 4.30. Um, I had a migraine last night and went to bed semi-early, for me at least. And um, I like woke up to pee at 4.30 and I had not been able to get back to sleep. My husband just left for work and I made us breakfast. I made us some breakfast burritos, so I have that over here. It's just some sausage and egg and a piece of cheese. <laughs> Nothing fancy. Um, of course, Caden is still asleep, so I'm trying to be really quiet. Enjoy the quietness that is my house, but I know that. Um, I hope he takes a nap later because I'm going to need it. <laughs> my husband said, you're going to regret this. I'm like, I can't help it. I literally laid in bed for two hours trying to go back to sleep, and I couldn't, so... Just going to watch some YouTube videos and eat my breakfast and enjoy the quiet time while it lasts. Do you guys like my cup? I need it. <laughs> I don't normally drink coffee. Well, not often at least unless I need it. Um, but I like to put the vanilla creamer in it. Then I don't need any sugar, so that's good too. <laughs> hey everyone, so it's like 9 o'clock and I'm still hanging out. Caden is sleeping, so I've kind of enjoyed the quiet morning. Um, I am watching a show I found called Secrets and Lies um, on Hulu. It looks like a relatively new show. There's only three episodes on, so... I like, I like shows like this, like a mystery, crime kind type of show. Um, and earlier I was watching um, The Unbreakable Kimmy Schmidt on Netflix, which is really funny. Um, it's like, um, it's written, I think it's written by Tina Fey, so it's, it's a cute like little, I guess it's like a sitcom kind of, um, so yeah. See how much longer this quiet time lasts. Caden's awake, finally, yay! He's got some scrambled eggs and some OJ. These are the new cups that I that I got from Amazon. They're born free. They have this little thing on the side so you can see how much is in there. Um, so far, we like them. I like that there's minimal parts and they don't have that rubber stout thing that that gets like mold up in it. So that's good. And he's got his car. He's ready to go. Hey guys, so I've like not vlogged at all today. Um, yeah, Caden wants to play. He brought me into his room. I don't know what he wants to play with. Oh, his closet door is open. What do you want to play with? With what? Um. Now... You see he opened his closet. I have baby stuff in here because we don't have anywhere else to put it right at the moment. I'll play. Oh goodness gracious. I'll Let's see what he wants play. to play with. Should be this is what Caden wanted to play with. He got this track for um, Christmas. I have old batteries in that train. <laughs> um, but he, want, he got a train for Christmas. As you can see the dog is really excited about it. Fix it. There we go. Anyway, he got a train for Christmas. He got these these little trains. Um, it's a Brio brand. I got some sort of lightning deal on Amazon, and they had really good reviews. Um, I have no idea even how much they cost. But, um, I wanted to get them for him. So the main one, I don't know train terms. Um, help it up the hill. Move, Lily. You. We gotta help him. Okay. Anyways, so um, yeah, I had really good reviews, so I grabbed those, and then I obviously needed a track, so I got this yeah. Melissa and Doug track, and um, it's kind of like the starter eight eight. What's it called? I don't know. Figure eight, I guess you'd say. 
Tom. And everybody said in the reviews for those trains that they work well with the uh, Melissa and Doug track. Um, it's just, they kind of suck right now because I have, like I said, I actually took a remote battery out of it. Like a, like a battery, excuse me, that comes standard with a remote. Like it's like a Phillips battery. Um, so I think it's about to die, which Yay, sucks. But anyway, yeah. so they came separately and then I got the track and then these trains, this little two piece train, it's not battery operated. It operated. I don't know why I just stuttered there. Um, they're just, uh, kind of trains. They're both magnetic. So are those, they're all magnetic. And, um, those two, you just kind of push them around the track. So I'm actually surprised he has a Thomas um, track that's like real big and plastic and he, I mean, it's been a while since we put it together. I don't even know if we have the, are you super excited? Track. Yeah, track. He's got a Thomas one and um, uh, every time we'd put it together, he would destroy it. So pretty excited about this. What's, what's wrong, buddy? But it's really funny because these are the instructions. And it literally took me 15 minutes to put this thing together because I'm retarded and did not realize that these pieces you can flip over. So I had a bunch of the, I feel so stupid. I had a bunch of these flipped um, upside down. And so I didn't think I had enough. Because if you notice, like one end is, they, they call it on the paper, uh, male and female. So one is male and one is female. And I had them flipped, so I had a bunch of them going one direction and not enough. And then I realized, 15 Coming. minutes later, that they were you could flip them over, which I felt Coming. really stupid. Coming. Yeah. So anyways, that's what we're doing right now. We're playing the trains. 